Hey guys, Amy Songbird here. Bet you thought I forgot to post today, huh? It's not like it's like 7.53 at night, California time. But, um, no, it was another busy day. You know, being a housewife, it kind of stays that way. But, um, the boys showed up two and a half hours early. I'm sitting there working on my work, you know, trying to work on getting the Run Jesse part out for tonight and getting, you know, the thumbnail and everything done. And I get a text on my phone from my youngest stepson and he goes, Hey, is it cool? We want to come over early. And it's like, yeah, you guys can come over early. It's like two and a half hours early. I'm looking at my invisible watch. <laughs> I go, yeah, you guys can come by anytime. You know, I'll go unlock the gate. Come on in, whatever. So they show up and I was getting ready to fix our dinner. You know, we do the same dinner every Friday night. It's just me and the kids because Sean's working. So, you know, me and the kids hang out and we have our dinner. I cook us dinner and we sit down and have our movie night. You know, it's our weekly thing. So I sit down, I'm getting ready to get up and fix dinner. And my youngest looks at me and goes, can we have pancake poofs? Yeah, funny word, get over the poofs. We love the poofs. That's what the thumbnail is for this video. I didn't do it to make you guys hungry on purpose, sorry. But I have this little cake pop maker that sits up on my counter and I bought it going, ooh, brownie bites, brownie bites and ice cream. I need that, I got to have that. So I bought it and right after I bought it, I'm sitting there one day going, what am I gonna fix for dinner? And there's three boys in our house. You know, 21, 12, 10. There's never enough food in my house between them, my husband, and then there's me, right? So there's never enough food, you know, and I'm usually busy. So it's like, oh, shit, now what am I going to cook? I've been working all day. I'm tired. So I take and I make the pancake batter, and sometimes I throw syrup in it and bacon because I don't like heating up the griddle. It heats up the whole damn house. But I have this little countertop cake pop maker. So I'm going, hmm. And I mix the batter, I throw in the bacon, a little bit of syrup, you know, and mix it up. And I start popping it into the cake pop maker, right, to sit on the counter. And I start cooking them, and all of a sudden that day, the kids are like... <laughs> and I turn around, they're coming into the kitchen. My husband's coming into the kitchen. Do I smell bacon? <laughs> and they look, and they had these little cake pops on this plate, you know. It looked like cake balls, you know. And they ate the crap out of them. It took me forever to finally get the picture of it to put up for my thumbnail this time. But I sat and made the pancake balls and pancake poofs. The kids named them. That's their official name, pancake poofs. But they like anything they can eat with their fingers. And with them, they never sit still for five seconds. So getting them to eat anything good for them, I feel like a winner then. But, um, yeah, we did that. And they've been here a lot longer than they were supposed to be, which is cool. I love hanging out with the kids, having them here. It's so much fun. And they're still bugging me because they want me to put up some Let's Plays. And I laugh because I play video games with my stepsons all the time. It's so cute. My youngest stepson loves the drums and th he thinks the Beatles are the shit, right? I introduced him to the Beatles like a year ago and their music and played all their music through on the rock band, the Beatles. And he sits down and rocks out to the drums and I do the guitar. And, you know, I introduce them to new games all the time from things I watch. Where I go, you know, you guys would be into this. You might learn something here. Call it educational. Go. Have fun. You know, so they're like, well, we want to see you play this game and record it. And I'm going, I'm not a Let's Player. I'm barely a YouTuber, guys. I'm a writer. You know, I don't want to, you know. So eventually I may have to make a separate playlist for the boys and put up a couple of videos so you guys could laugh at me because I'm not <laughs> a Let's Player. I'm not talented enough to be a Let's Player. I don't have the coordination or the patience. I give you guys so much credit. So yeah, I'm going to put up uh, Run Jesse after this. Why do I keep wanting to call it Dear Jesse? And I'm working on a project that has to do with Jesse right now. It's been the craziest day. I've been doing that and I've been making potholders and I've been working in the yard and I feel like a scatterbrain that needs five million clones running 50 miles an hour and none of them would know what to do. So it's like, <laughs> I need a vacation. But yeah, I won't drone on and on and on with you guys, but <clears throat> I'm going to put up Run Jesse tonight and it had been a couple days since I did a vlog, so I wanted to do a vlog with me and my new microphone. And I'm a wreck. Look, if you look at my shirt, you can't even see my shirt, but if you looked at my shirt right now, I have batter everywhere. 
Serious, I have pancake batter all over. Oh, see? Pancake batter. <laughs> I'm lucky it's not in my hair. Somehow I ended up with syrup in my hair. That's what I get, right? Pancake poops. Letting the boys dip the syrup and the syrup ends up everywhere. Shit. <laughs> but having boys, it's so hard to find meals that they'll eat, let alone that they ask for. So I always feel like a winner when they come back and go, we like that thing you made. You need to make that thing you made. Remember the one time the thing you made that day you made it? Yeah, we like that thing, but not that other thing you made the other day that you made it, because that was gross. You gotta make the thing you made. Yeah, those things. <laughs> oh shit, one out of 50 thing I, things I make, they actually like. So, pancake poofs. <laughs> My genius is pancake poofs. <laughs> but yeah, the things that amaze the kids. It never gets old with me. So, yeah, here in the near future, I may cave to their puppy dog eyes and have to put up a video or two of me sucking so bad at video games. It's not even real. I could see me sitting there with my headset. I'm going to attempt not to suck today. Mission failed. But I gave it a valiant effort. <laughs> but no, I'm going to let you guys go because I'm going to drone because I'm tired and my brain is not functioning and I still have to get Run Jesse up tonight. Part two. I hope you guys are enjoying that one. I had a lot of fun writing it and I'm still working on a project that has to do with Jesse and I'm enjoying the ever living shit out of it. But it was a fun story and people are looking at me like I'm demented and I'm going, you have no idea. <laughs> you can't be a person that, you know, yeah, you can't be completely sane. It's not as fun. But yeah, I'll let you guys go, and I hope you guys have a great day, and I don't even know if I'm posting this vlog, because 90% of my vlogs are just me rambling. And I laugh because my friend Amanda texts me and goes, I like your vlog. I'm going. I was rambling. It's 90% of the time sleep deprivation and caffeine overload. And you put those two together and brain frazzled from family. <laughs> and, and you get... Ta da Right? So, yeah. I'm going to let you guys go because I need more coffee. So, you guys have a great rest of your day. And I hope you guys hang around for Run Jesse. Part 2 is going up tonight and Part 3 is going up tomorrow. And the rest of it will be up a part at a time each day after that until the end. Alright, you guys have a great night. This has been A.V. Songbird. Night, guys.